you're not big yet, but we are growing. We have not filled in these feet that want to walk across. No, no, stomp across the universe. We want to plant our flag in every orbiting rock out there in the vast black skies above. We want to know everything and create insight. But we are made by it because we are not big yet. We are little. We are fragile. We are small. I've heard it said that the energy released by a hydrogen bomb is roughly equal to the energy stored in the atoms of one kitten. <laughs> Helpless, defenseless, lost, like us in blind courage and entirely unafraid. Maybe not like we should be. No, no, we play. We tear across the comfort of living room carpets. We walk on shaky legs unfamiliar with gravity and look out into the universe with eyes barely open where we see so much and want to touch it all, to feel it with our paws. I've also heard it said the energy released by the sun in one second is roughly equal to one billion kittens. <laughs> one billion kittens brightly shining at the center of slumbering ancient gods. And we yearn to play with them, to wake them up, one billion kittens grow gardens in rainforests and sunburns on treeless beaches when we left the sunscreen in the car. Eh, too far away to bother with. And they do it with a gaze. One billion kittens hissing, trapped in layers of atmosphere, bouncing from stratosphere to troposphere, stopping at the tropopause to lick their paws before growing hot with frustration arching backs, batting attacks with needle toes and skin exposed to the unintended rage of one billion kittens <laughs> who define the shade while scratching cancers more and more as days pass deeper into the frayed, twisting ends of this story. But their rage is not our fault because we are not big yet. We've only just learned to walk. We, we hobble on shaky legs, unaccustomed to gravity. We look out beyond the blueness of the skies we see to the center of a galaxy that we just can't quite reach. And there we see a black hole, exactly equal to billions of billions of kittens. <laughs> Stretching limbs, suckling at stars, quietly lapping at the Milky Way, oblivious to me and to you, to these billions of billions of kittens, we pose no threat. And they pose no threat to us, even though they scratch small rips in the skin of thin membranes that separate dimensions where everything is possible. And the least of all that is real is also probable. But they mean us no harm. Even though they crush planets and stars and star systems, absorbing them, dwarfing them, batting at ticking neutron stars like little balls with bells. But they pose us no threat. They're only doing what billions of billions of kittens would do. Oh. <laughs> and we want to play with them to wake the earth. <laughs> Sorry. We want to rub against their singularity and claim it as our own. We want to see the light that cannot escape the event of our own horizon. If we could, we would witness everything between our feet and the still collective of those billions of billions of kittens way out there. If we could truly see, we would witness just how small we really are. Maybe one day we'll be as big as them. We'll no longer seek only the comfort of living room carpets. We will walk on sturdy legs, in lighted rooms and palaces made of unity built on found foundations of harmony so of songs sung by the ancient gods themselves. We will properly fear our ignorance, yet still choose to gently poke at Ursa Major. We will feel the stars rolling around in the palms of our hands and ask for nothing in return. We will be a 
billion cats safely illuminating lazy summer beaches. And one day, far, far off into the ever-expanding future, we will collide with everything that we could wish to be, like billions of billions of kittens. <laughs> We won't fret. We won't worry about... <laughs> we won't fret plastic waste or worry about sore paws that can't do enough to make things the way they ought to be. We won't hiss and bat each other over the head to, to protect a scrap of petroleum. We will turn our cheeks, but only for bathing kisses because we'll be grown-up cats and in love with everything. We will run on strong legs, racing, racing gravitational waves to the center of every galaxy. But for now, we are still too small. We are only the power of one kitten. Power enough to end a war. Power enough to divert one if we're lucky. Power enough to make one when we're not. We have kitten ideals not yet fully developed. One kitten clutching lives like balls of yarn with frayed ends twisting to the ends of this story. We're not as big as we feel. We're not big yet. But we are growing.